Welcome to another CAT wheel loader tips video. Today I want to introduce you to the controls of this 903C2 compact wheel loader. So let's go take a look. Now I want to point out a few items in the cab of this 903C2. First is your parking brake handle. So as you park the machine you want to engage that. Second is going to be your shift column right here and so you got forward reverse and you can lock that out with this convenient red handle right here. You've got your differential lock so if you start to spin the tires you can stomp on that and that'll engage all four wheels. And then last you'll notice that it has a dual brake pedal set up. So if you like running dual foot you can have your right foot on the throttle, left foot on your inching pedal or brake pedal. Otherwise, if you like running with just one foot, you can use your right foot for the throttle and your inching pedal as well. Now let's go take a look at some of the items on the opposite side of the cab. Now operating this machine couldn't be easier. You've got your mechanical lift and tilt lever, and then if you're running a hydromechanical work tool, you've got your auxiliary lever that does come standard with continuous flow. Also standard is your return to dig feature. So as you dump that bucket, you flip this in and it's going to bring that bucket to wherever you set it. So you can set it nice and level to ensure a smooth entry into the pile. The last item I want to point out is your switch for your electric quick coupler. Now for applications where you're changing work tools often, it's nice not to have to get out of the cab. So if, you, if your machine is equipped with a quick coupler, that's a great feature. For more information about your 903C2 compact wheel loader, please contact your local CAT dealer or click on the links provided.